here we are the next day and <laughs> mm, it's quite solid very solid actually and it says you're supposed to mix it up again I haven't got a hand mixer so I'm going to use me immersion blender, stick blender, whatever you like to call it and see what that does so I'll just plug that in now and see how it goes so here goes it's all mixed up now and it looks good so take this out now I treated myself and bought a container for it soon as I'm going to be making my own and it I thought it might unscrew but it doesn't seem to right also I've got some empty containers that I'm going to fill up as well and let's just pour it in Looks a bit like emulsion paint. Whoop. Way overfill that one. But never mind, it's safe. So it isn't as though it's going to do you any harm. And it feels nice. It smells lovely because I, I do like the smell of that soap. Out. and put the pump dispenser top in. and there it is there it is my hand so let's fill these up so much I've got spare at least I can see through these so not that bad <laughs> I won't overspill my hands off again. Now I'm glad I didn't make a gallon of it because I would have run out of containers because there's still some left. Let's put it in the top of the one that's in the kitchen. It's not the quickest homemade product, but it is easy. And that was just topping it up. But that one bar of soap, which is 33 pence, I've made three of these. Three. That's ten pence each. You go to a shop and you spend a pound on the cheap no um, brand one, and I've gone for ten p. This is definitely another one for doing. So, yay! Well, out you come. There you are. 
So that is brilliant. Definitely going to keep doing this. So out of the pack of three for a pound, I can make nine of these and a little bit uh, as well for topping up. So call it ten. That's a good saving. Thank you. Bye. It's a pearl.